Pay rise, inflation, consumer price index, horror, trade union battle row. As Peter Gravy reports. Official figures show the Australian economy is going down the tubes again, faster than AIDS in a gay bar. The Prime Minister and former folk legend Bob Hope called on trade unions to exercise restraint. Uh, well, uh, uh, Max, uh, have I called on the unions, uh, the ITUC, uh, to exercise restraint? Uh, for go uh, significant uh, pay rise uh, in respect of the national wage cut. Well, Prime Minister. Uh, let me finish, uh, if I may. Uh, excessive uh, trade uh, union demands uh, cause uh, of all our troubles in respect of the economy. Uh, uh, frankly, I'm uh, uh, fed up with the union's failure to understand it. Well, well forgive me, you're a former folk legend, but didn't you used to be a president of the ATUC? No, uh, yes, uh, well... And um, you are uh, now a Labour Prime Minister of the Labour government. Is this true? Uh, up to point, uh, Peter, uh, up to point. In other horror news, there's been a major shock clash over Liberal Party policy on just about everything with a raw conflict between new Liberal Party President Mr. Valium and opposition leader Andrew Gucci. Look, now, now listen, I'm going to make it pretty plain right here that we don't have any policy on anything at all. And anyone who says we do, well, just, well, it's pretty serious. Well, Mr. Gucci flew immediately to the United States hoping to purchase some second-hand policies from the White House. Peter Gravy, cut, bro. Oh, thank you, Brian. Good evening. A uh, football shock on the uh, fabulously wealthy Sydney doctor, Jeffrey Goldstone, has bought the Sydney Ducks football team the amazing figure of $6.3 million. Well, frankly, I was flabbergasted. Uh, flabbergasted. <coughs> Paying all that sort of money for the sort of football team was a bit like buying a first-class ticket on the next voyage of the Titanic. The sources close to Dr. Goldstone explain he didn't like the football team, just the television commercial, although he does intend to change the words a bit. Up there for Jeffrey. Jeffrey, come on. Six million dollars. Where's the money gone? And that's the sport. Uh, back to you, Brian. Thanks, Rocks. The band is for Friday, August 2, 19...